I am Tsikhofato Mati and I am the CEO and founder of Mr. Soweto Empowerment Program. Dr. Botella, we are at Makonya today on the 16th. Why did you choose this particular date? The reason we chose this date is because it's Youth Day number one. And it being Youth Day, we remember those that got us to where we are on this day. And we found it that it will be relevant because we are also celebrating women who are coming onto this program as women who are coming as themselves. Changing the narrative that if you're going to go into platforms that are, would ordinarily be referred to as a pageant, you need to be a certain size, you need to have a certain look. So we were saying here we are as Mrs. Soweto and we would like to present to you what Mrs. Soweto stands for, that it is women from all walks of life, from all different cultures, all different shapes and sizes. So so that's why we decided to celebrate it on June 16. And the turnout, are you happy with the turnout today? Wow, I am completely overwhelmed. Um, I, it's, it's, nothing, it's beyond the imagination that I had. The support was, was, it was shocking. It was beyond, I just, I kept on looking and there was just people, people, people everywhere. So I am, I'm very grateful that the Sowetans came out and they stopped what they were doing to take that moment to celebrate with us as we were officially sashing the finalists for the first official Mrs. Soweto. And I know that you are a very busy woman. Do you still have time to do your own things? I know that you are a doctor, you are a woman, you are helping other women, and you are also a mother, a wife. Do you have time to do other things and be yourself? I actually do. And the reason is because I'm, hey, I'm very... I'm very finicky with my time. Everything of mine has to be, everything is scheduled. You know, I've got time to work, I've got time for family, I've got time to be a mom, I've got time. I've got time to do everything because I work according to a schedule, I work according to a diary. So in that way, I am able to fulfill all of my roles, not feeling too much under pressure. So being the Mrs. Soweto, I want you to motivate the finalists. Just talk to them, maybe from your heart, what should they do in the interim before the actual event? First and foremost, I want the women, I want you ladies to enjoy the journey. And as I've always said, it's about you being yourself. It's about being comfortable with who you are and allowing the other women who are also part of the journey to get to know you. So it's not about, yes, it's a competition, but it's first about building you, it's about empowering you, it's about giving you, uh, equipping you with information, with knowledge that is going to make you a better person. So focus on, on building yourself, on building yourself as a brand, on gaining as much as you can. As you know here at Mrs. Soweto, it's all about filling cups. So make sure that you fill your cup, be full and let your cup overflow with everything that we are sharing with you, that we are exposing you to on the journey. So please enjoy the journey, have fun, because um, you want to look back on the finale and say, wow, I did this, I did that. You don't want to find yourself in a moment where you are so focused on winning that you forget to enjoy the moments of the journey. So I want you to speak about the 12th. I want you to motivate someone that has not bought their ticket as yet. Talk to them, it's your platform. So, the 12th of August, you do not want to miss this one. You want to come and see what is this Mrs. Soweto that everybody has been talking about. Who are these women, this first group that is making history? Come to Soweto Theatre on the 12th of August. The tickets are already out, people are buying. So you want to come and witness, witness this thing that has got people talking and wondering and curious. What is this Mrs. Soweto, who are they? Come and see what we mean when we say we are going all out, we are changing. We want the women of Soweto to remember who they are. And we are saying, come and see at Soweto Theater and understand who Mrs. Soweto is, what we are about, and what it is that you can get out of Mrs. Soweto, what we can give you when you get onto the platform. So you want to be there on the 12th. Are we ready? Are we ready for the 12th now? We are ready. No, like we are ready. I'm, I'm serious. We are ready. We just want that date to come.